1960s. Hardly any art form is funkier than pop art. Although the movement began in Great Britain in the 1950s, it really took off the following decade in the United States. Artists called from the most common images of popular culture and transformed them from dreary icons of mass production into works of art. Advertising on TV or in magazines provided a wealth of material for the painters to work with. In an attempt to bring life to their art, many pop artists engaged in happenings or performance art. These were one-time events that could have been as simple as burying a TV or as elaborate as a mass body painting event. One of the leading proponents was a successful commercial illustrator who turned his talents to lampooning the very objects he had worked with. This was Andy Warhol. His New York studio, Factory, was a constant party for artists, intellectuals, rock stars, Hollywood celebrities, and Bohemian street people. If you wanted your 15 minutes of fame, you went to Andy's place. Mid-Century New York Mid-Century New York The French Neoclassical Period The French Neoclassical Period 1600s Netherlands 1600s Netherlands 17th century Kyoto 17th century Kyoto The Italian High Renaissance The Italian High Renaissance Hellenistic Greece Hellenistic Greece The Bent Eugles Rome The Bent Eugles Rome Hey guys, thank you so much for the support and likes and comments down below and also thank you so much for watching and I look forward to see you in the next video then take care Bye